Good afternoon, everybody. This is Steve Fletcher with the Trumpet for My People. Today is March 29th, 2022, and I want to share with you a, an article written by T.W. Tram, Why April Fool's Day is no joke this year. Looking at God's calendar, April Fool's Day, 2022. This is part six in our Rapture Watch series looking at Nissan 1 April 1st through April 3rd 2022. On the first day of April every year people in countries around the world play hoaxes or pranks on each other afterwards shouting April Fools. While the exact origin of April Fools Day is unknown historians generally attribute it to a calendar change in 1582, when Pope Gregory changed the new year from April, the month Christians traditionally observed the new year, to January, many were either uninformed or refused to adopt the change. Those who observed the new January new year began to make fun of these traditionalists, sending them on fool's errands or trying to trick them into believing something false. The practice of mocking observers of the April new year eventually spread throughout Europe in France, April New Year observers were marked with paper fish, a reference to the Christian ictus or fish symbol on their backs. These gullible victims were known as Poison de Avril, meaning April fish, which is still the French term for April Fools today. The medieval hullabaloo over the change of the new year raises the question, does God really care when we observe the new year? The answer is, yes, he does. As the Lord was preparing the Israelites to come out of Egypt some 3,500 years ago, one of the first things he instructed them on was the timing of the new year. The Lord said to Moses, this month, Nisan, is to be for you the first month, the first month of your year. Exodus 12, 1 and 2. Observing the correct New Year is as important today as it was in ancient Israel. As key end times prophecies, particularly in the book of Daniel, involving, involve a reckoning of years. To be uninformed of the biblical New Year is to be uninformed of God's prophetic timing. Case in point, because so few, even students of Bible prophecy, observe God's true New Year, they are unaware that the impending Nissan 1 marks a profound, a profound convergence of eschatological timelines. For the details of this convergence, please see my short video or article entitled 10 Reasons Nissan 1 is a Pivotal Date in 2022. I also shared that article, that video on my channel, and it is part three of this series. I will leave the link for you in the description box. Seeming to confirm the significance of the approaching Nissan is a dramatic ramp up of end time signs of late, including a Russian invasion that threatens to turn into World War III, a burgeoning food and energy crisis, and spiraling inflation. One of the most telling signs is that despite rising prices and growing concerns about the economy, business is booming. Massive government stimulus and pent-up consumer demand related to a once-in-a-century pandemic are driving spending and record inflation. At the same time, because large gatherings are no longer banned due to the pandemic, 2022 is seeing a surge in weddings. Here are some high headlines from the recent news articles. U.S. inflation soared 7.9 in past year, a fresh 40-year high. Signet Jewelers says weddings will hit a 40-year high this year. That inflation and weddings are peaking simultaneously at a 40-year high in 2022 is significant as Jesus says Judgment Day will arrive at a time when people are buying selling and marrying. The bottom line is that a convergence of prophetic timelines suggests Nissan 1 is a pivotal date this year 
and a recent escalation of signs seems to confirm it. So when is Nissan 1? Due to a relatively rare synchronization of the biblical and Gregorian calendars, the astronomical new moon heralding the month of Nisan occurs at 9.24 a.m. Jerusalem time on the first day of April. For this reason, April Fool's Day is no joke this year. <laughs>